Hey guys, how's it going? And welcome back to another episode. Today's episode, here you know what we're doing, Monday Motivation. That's right. Now, unfortunately, I can't uh, go outside because it's raining. It's been raining all week. I mean, all week, all day, sorry. It's been raining all day long. And then on top of that, it's gonna be raining all weekend long. We're actually hoping it doesn't rain too much this weekend because uh, basically, you know, me and Christian are we were planning on going away for the weekend uh, and we were planning on uh, just uh, you know um, having a little a few days off you know just going to the beach you know we, we were able to find a nice little place where we could kind of like rent out and hang out for the you know for a couple days and just relax and all that good stuff um, and that's what we're gonna be doing today is actually Thursday by the time you're watching this we're already on our way back home okay because uh, you know we'll be driving home on Monday and be here, you know, Monday early. Here, let me show you a little bit of what we're doing. We got some of those nice yummy pork chunks. The fried pork, so yummy and delicious. If you guys want to know how to cook this from scratch, go check out my cooking channel, wherever I have already made this. Um, but yeah, we're having this with some of the leftover beans uh, and all that good stuff, and uh, that's what we're doing. So let's get to the whole motivational part of this. So basically, um, I want to be doing. Uh, I want to do a Monday motivational video for you guys, just because of the fact that, well, I want to keep you know the schedule. I want to keep going. It's part of my motivation too. You know what I mean? It's how this whole motivational thing works. You know, it's like riding a bicycle. You know what I mean? You got to keep pedaling because if you're not pedaling, well, you're gonna fall off the bike. Well, unless you got a kickstand or something. But again, you don't want to crutch, do you? You want to keep going. You want to keep advancing no matter what. So, you know, with that being said, you know, that's, you know, what, what I've been doing here. You know what I mean? Like, uh, I just started, you know, riding the bike again, um, you know, in more ways than one. Uh, meaning that we started, uh, you know, making more videos uh, on the bike <laughs> and so on and so forth. And today I was actually going to get on the bike and do a Monday motivation because I have an errand I got to go run. But at this rate, I'm probably going to have to go take an Uber because I'm not going to get soaking wet and get that. COVID-19 but anyways you know definitely don't want another corona you know so you know I gotta take care of myself right so um, that's why I just decided to stay home and just do a quick you know Monday motivational video just to let you know that we're back you know we're gonna be doing this on a regular basis not just these Monday motivations but all kinds of videos as you guys already saw I posted a video on Thursday on this channel on, on the travel channel I posted three videos last week uh, we were only able to do two live streams um, on the cooking channel um, we you know definitely uh, kicked some ass on the podcast it was a lot of fun last week and uh, and again you already know this week you already got your monday motivation you're gonna have another video on the travel channel um you're definitely gonna have uh you know the podcast coming tomorrow um and um a live stream a cooking live stream probably coming tomorrow as well and just to keep on going and uh you know the reason i'm telling you all this is because part of the motivation from what i've seen oh let me make sure you guys are seeing me there. okay okay yeah part of the motivation from what i've seen is the fact that like you know you guys see me just constantly doing and doing and doing and non-stop and so you know by watching me doing what i do it encourages you guys to also do the same and also again you don't have to do all of that you just got to do one of those things but when you see someone like me doing all of these things it's like bro what's your excuse for not doing one of them you know and again not doing videos or anything like that for you you know whatever it is that you need to do with you and so you know again today's video um the whole motivational aspect of today's video is the fact that you know well I had to motivate myself here. Let me show you real quick. So I'm working right now. Okay, see, I'm doing a little research. Um, it's just on how to do some hash brown for the breakfast episode that I'm going to be doing tomorrow. Um, but what I'm saying is that, like, uh, you know, part of the whole motivational aspect of what we're doing today um, in this episode is the fact that you got to push yourself no matter what. You know, you got to, like, really, if you really want it, then you got to go get it. And this is part of that. You know what I mean? It's very easy to just lay back be lazy chill you know start packing for tomorrow's uh you know for the trip tomorrow start getting ready you know get my books you know get my cameras and, and all that stuff so that i can uh, again enjoy um more of the weekend but i'm not gonna really be able to enjoy the weekend unless i get all this done i just finished not only uploading episodes but i finish uh editing episodes i still got this one now that i'm gonna you know um edit and upload and have ready for you guys on monday um 
I'm also getting ready the cooking live stream. Again, I would much rather just be laying on the ground like this guy. Hey, what's up, buddy? How's it going? Loving life. But unfortunately, I'm a different kind of an animal. And uh, as much as I want to just be laying like this guy, look at him. As much as I want to be living this life, you know, I can't. You know what I mean? Like, I, I have other things that make me tick. And part of that is uh, doing all the things that I do. And the fact that I have an outlet. I have, uh, um, you know, an audience, you know, that also is uh, enjoying, you know, um, a lot of the content, most of the content that I make. Well, then, again, it's... it's it's like part of therapy, part of catharsis, you know, all that stuff where I just got to keep going and going. So look, I mean, this goes for anything, you know, same thing as like, let's say working out, changing your diet, you know, leaving a toxic relationship. I mean, you know, whatever it is, it's all part of that whole same deal. You know what I mean? Where you got to keep doing that work and keep it up and you got to maintain it because again, it's like, you know, very, if I don't do anything, I could very easily just uh, kind of like zone out, zone out for the weekend. Um, and then I'm gonna be just tortured of like, damn, I should have made that video. Damn, I should have done this. Damn, I should have done that. I never really enjoy myself during the weekend. But if I bust out all of this work, well, I'm really gonna be able to enjoy the weekend. Then again, it doesn't matter that it's raining. As I was just telling Christian, I'm like, you know what? Maybe this rain is a little bit of a blessing in disguise. You know, when it came to, uh, you know, the weather, you know, for the plans for the beach and all that stuff, you know, simply because, um, it's, I mean, the beach is great and wonderful. I mean, we're still gonna get in the water. You know what I mean? It's not gonna be raining, you know, four days straight um but here let me show you this we are watching more than one disturbance the yellow x shows the one that is east of the lesser antilles it's disorganized with low chances of development the red x invest 91l more of an immediate concern potentially for the u.s there are much higher chances this will become a tropical depression or storm now the latest model runs have pulled this even further over the yucatan and the southern gulf and ultimately how much the system remains over open water will tell us what its next move could possibly be Certainly, the rainfall that's expected for southern Mexico and Central America is going to be abundant. Some of the initial computer models have been hinting that it could form into a depression by early next week, but we still have to watch it. So we are well into the Greek alphabet at the G name of Gamma. Here's a look at the remainder of the Greek alphabet names for 2020. This bears watching. All right, what do you think about that? Anyways, uh, yeah, I know, right? Famous last words. I really doubt that it's going to be raining without stopping, but... Regardless, after you saw that, you know, um, it's very easy to discourage yourself, you know, or be discouraged into like the trip, you know what I mean? Like, damn, you know what I mean? It's gonna be raining and shitty and horrible. But the reality is, is like this, look, I get enough sun, she gets enough sun on a daily basis living out here, the life that we live and all that stuff. The, what, the main reason we're doing this and we planned this out er, earlier before the rain um, was to relax and chill and do nothing. So the reality is that if it's just raining nice and soft like this the weather has come down significantly because we're now in, in hitting fall and this is part of the cold front you know part of the all the you know changing of the weather that's coming to, to this area um you know again it's gonna be a nice trickle you know nice little rain you know kind of like the white noise you know we got the you know it's gonna the, the weather's gonna be nice and cool you know we're you know this is like perfect relaxed weather you know what i mean we're just gonna be able to sit back you know break open a couple bottles of wine um you know read our books chillax relax and do nothing do absolutely like literally lounge for a few days and disconnect in fact we're going to an area where we'll be able to disconnect very easily from the internet also why i want to do a lot of this work you know to make sure that you know i don't fall too behind on my schedule but the reality is again i don't really have to do anything at all i got plenty you know of uh, work and plenty of things to do and plenty of clients and plenty of projects and plenty of everything but this is something that i just want to do and i just con continuously want to do it i'm not just talking about this monday motivational video but i'm talking about everything else that i do you know all the other videos all the other channel everything from like again i gotta wake up tomorrow morning you know like around six in the morning just to get everything ready so that i can do a cooking live stream and uh you know um then head out you know what i mean uh you know then get everything else ready and head out um to the beach but you're like, well, why am I doing the cooking live stream? Well, it's like this, you know, we're gonna start off a nice, uh, fun little mini vacation, you know, me and Christian. So I was like, you know what? It'd be a great way that, you know, as you know, a great start to the vacation would be like, oh, let me make a nice big breakfast for the both of us. And so I was like, you know what? Perfect, I can film it. And that can be the, the breakfast live stream. And that's it, and that's what we're doing. And that's what I do here. Let me uh, flip this guys a little more. So 
as you guys see we're just slowly cooking this guy away so you know again today's monday motivation is just hanging out at the house with me hanging out on a thursday afternoon um as we're getting everything ready to do what we got to do all right you already know so you gotta earn that little vacation you know even though i know i've already earned it but it's not the point you know what i mean i still gotta get some work done cook some food and all that stuff so by the way christian's the one that's cooking these i'm just in the kitchen now so i'm just flipping them around but you know she learns like i learned from her we learn from each other not just uh cooking but all kinds of things and uh, we make all kinds of yummies so now she knows how to make these and she makes them and we already got some like i said leftover beans and we're just going to eat whatever's in the fridge so we leave the fridge nice and empty you know whatever we don't eat we give the uh, to gizmo gizmo is going to be coming with us so he can enjoy the beach and all that good stuff you know so it's gonna be great there you go hope you guys enjoyed that porky goodness so um like i said guys you know what i mean if you enjoy what you do and you enjoy your life um it's it's up to you as well that you know for you to keep that up you know because it's like all this takes a lot of work in order for me to continuously like let's say a week from now two weeks from now three weeks a month from now for my life to still continue to be awesome well i gotta continue to do all the things that got me here you feel me so like i said i can very easily stop and chill and do nothing but then the life that i'm gonna live in the future will be completely different and it could be very chill and relaxed and awesome and all this other stuff but maybe not and the reality is that everything i'm doing now and all these things that are happening to me in my personal life at the moment are things that i want to do and um they're all you know clicking together and i just gotta keep on going and going because you know it's it's not disappointing me at all the complete opposite you know what i mean every every step i take just brings me closer to where i want to be and that's the thing again that's all part of the motivation too because again it's very easy to give up or stop you know even when you're making progress as as uh as weird as that might sound can you see me there all right as weird as that might sound you know it, it's, it's actually it can be very difficult to maintain that mo uh, momentum and maintain that motivation and maintain that uh, course um but trust me i totally get that that's why i'm making this video talking about this and i continuously push myself because pushing myself not only do i get better results not only do am i happier with my life not only do i continuously you know just again you know grow what i want to grow but at the same time it just keeps me alive it keeps me alive you know basically that's that's simple as that you know what i mean like it like uh you're seeing those people that like uh uh i don't know they get like uh like a giant cut or some you know like a punch in the face and then they're like oh hey are you okay and they're like oh no I, that you know that that pain makes me feel alive well it's the same kind of thing you know all these things just make me feel alive if i'm not doing something if i'm not you know uh being productive then i feel like like shit. i mean honestly at least that's me and i think that's most people the thing is that you know even when you're being productive the reality is that when you're being productive for somebody else when you're working for somebody else when you're doing stuff for other people that's when you know everything just goes down the drain but when you're doing it for yourself it's very easy to remain focused and remain uh, on the ball but you got to do that work again it's I, I, all i want to do is you know lay down and eat chocolate and you know just be a fat chunky guy and watch tv all day and not have to worry about a damn thing but the reality is is that if if i do that i already know what the consequences of that are going to be i'm going to be depressed i'm going to be overweight i'm going to be you know like all of these horrible things well I, and again it's going to cause me hardship it's going to be difficult it's going to you know make me you know it's going to be all these difficult things well if i were to flip that around and just start doing these difficult things now like again push myself to make this video um do some exercise eat right um you know force myself to you know to remain positive and optimistic and and you know all of the things i do you know whether it's some push-ups or whether it's like cleaning my my kitchen and making a video about that and so on and so forth whatever the hell it is you know all that pain all that you know uh hardship that i'm going through will actually pay off because i'm going to get some positive and results and i'm in, and i'm the one that's in charge of uh you know the hardships i'm going to go through and the hardships i get to you know i that i have to like you know um yeah you know just uh, you know the hurdles that i have to jump over um as opposed to that you know again if i get really fat and super overweight i don't know what hurdles i'm going to have to jump over but they're going to be difficult and it's not just because i'm a fat chunky guy but also just because simply the fact that um you know it could be heart disease it could be diabetes 
It could be, um, you know what I mean? Like the fact that I can't get and sit in a car or, you know, or, or, or sit in an airplane anymore. Well, actually I can probably, you know, fat guys in, in airplanes are actually gonna be doing pretty good now because they get the whole row, but that's besides the point. You know what I'm saying? It's like all these other hardships that are gonna come anyway, but only you have no control over, and then, you know, things are just gonna get worse and worse and worse. And you already know that, you know what I mean? Like it's, 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 it's a spiral out of control, okay? So for example, you know what I mean? Like uh, if you wanna take drugs, you know, you have two options. You know, you either take them recreationally and you take them at the right time and you have a good time with it and then, you know, you get back to work and get back to what you gotta do, or you take them all the time, all the time, all the time to the point where it hinders you and the ability of what you wanna do and, the, and where you wanna to get to. And, and then on top of that, it messes everybody else around you up. And so on and so forth. So it's, again, I can go on and on with a million examples of all this stuff, but you know exactly what I'm saying. And so that's why you gotta motivate yourself. That's why you gotta you know, stay on the ball. That's why you gotta continue going and keep riding that bike because it's not just your world, but it's everyone around you and everything around you. You know, whether you want to, you know, admit that or not, whether you like it or not, but this is the reality of it. So instead of being the biggest piece of shit that you can be, why not try to be the best person that you can be? And that's it. Because look, I have, the people that really know me, there's a lot of you guys out there. You guys know I can be the biggest asshole on the planet. I can, I mean, man, don't fuck with me. All right, but at the same time, it's like, and well, instead of uh, focusing my energy on being that and being the worst possible person and being an asshole and being, you know, all this shit, why not focus on being the best human I can be? Why not focus my energy on trying to just constantly growing and making other people better and, and, and helping other people put foot on the food on the table and helping other people, you know, get to point A to point B and help other people grow and, you know, and all that shit. You know, I, I, why not do that? And that's what I choose to do. And that's what I encourage you guys to do. That's why I always tell you guys, you gotta take care of yourself before you can take care of anyone else. And that's why, again, the whole little mini vacation thing, because I gotta take care of myself so that I can be a 1,000%, not 100%, but a 1,000%, you know, for you guys. And why is it for you guys? Well, it really, it's for me, but it's for you guys, you know what I mean? Because I love what I do, so I gotta be able to, to be at 1,000% so that I can do what I do at my optimum, you know, at the, at the the top of my game, so that in the end you get the best possible Jose for whatever purposes. You get what I'm saying? You get the best possible Jose so that you you know you can uh, motivate yourself, so that you can learn something, so that you can whatever it is, whatever it is that you guys watch me for and 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 uh, and learn from me because there's so many many things why you guys watch me and uh, why I watch you guys and we learn from each other and all that stuff. It's mutual, believe it or not. All right. For a lot of you guys, you guys already know that we have a mutual relationship here. You know, some of you guys might only watch me and just uh, digest this and only that. But there's a lot of you guys in which, you know, we've already, uh, you know, main, you know, have, have a relationship, you know, maintain a relationship and we feed off each other and help each other out. And there's a lot of you guys out there, okay? And some of you guys already know some of these guys and some of these people. You know, I'll give a few shout outs. Fuck it, because you guys have earned it, you know what I mean? Everyone from, you know, whether it's Mr. Lodak to Opie to Hanson, the guy that I do the podcast with, to Hugo, and, and that can go on and on and on. You know, there's so many of you guys out there. All right, tons of you guys, all right? And there's a lot of new guys, and these are, I'm just talking about the OGs, old dogs out there, all right? No doubt about it, all right? For cheesy, my feezy, my cheesy, my kneesy. I don't know what I said there, but I know some of you guys know what I said there. And that's it, guys. It's all about that. It's all about building relationships, building, you know, um, bridges, you know, building, um, you know, a better life for you and everyone that you love around you. And it, all, and it, it basically, it takes a lot of work, but if you got full control, over what you're going to be doing well again you know what i mean it's going to be an easier ride things are just going to be a lot better you know what i mean for you to enjoy life all right and that's it and so we all got to work we all got to put effort we all got a lot of things that we got to do but the reality is is that you have total control over what you know goes on in your life whether you like it or not and uh, but in order for you to gain control you got to put in that work so you already know what to do Stop watching this video and get to work. So with that being said, all right, guys, you already know what time it is. It's time to get the hell out of here, all right? So, guys, thanks again for watching. You already know. Don't forget to please like, please subscribe, please share, please hit that bell icon. But more importantly than anything else, please stay awesome. Check out the website so that you can find everything I do. On the website, joseadiaga.com, link, link is at the bottom. You can find 
all the videos, all the channels, all the podcasts, all the Mexico Medina information, everything you could possibly want is all in one page, one stop shop. So go check it out, guys, all right? Thanks again for watching, and uh, you already know, I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.